Nature Park in the city of Easley officially opened Saturday, more than a decade after the plans were announced. 7 News reporter Nicole Ford tells us there's more to come. The Nally Brown Nature Trail spread throughout the woods here in the city of Easley. While most of it is finally complete, there's still some signs of work to be done. Up a quiet country road, there's an opening for growth. This is nice. It looks really pretty and it's nice and shaded, so it'll be great to go explore. Hidden beneath the trees are miles of brand new nature trails finally complete. And I put my head on that. Over a decade after the plans for the park were first announced. So the original plans called for um, about $5 million spent for this park. Um, it has been scaled back over time just due to some lost partnerships and things like that. With the city now solely funding the project, they spent $250,000 to complete the Nally and Brown trails, named after the families who donated the 38 acres of land in 2001. We go to the um, botanical gardens in Clemson a lot, but this is even closer, so that would be nice to just come right here. From trails to picnic tables, the idea is to create a place that preserves nature as the city grows, but it's not yet complete. This will be the ADA loop, so it'll be on a non-slip material that is completely ADA compliant um, and just to give the opportunity for everyone to enjoy this park. In time, the city will put the final touches on the park, including signs to help educate people on the different species in the woods. Once the boardwalks complete, it will allow people to walk over the areas where the stream runs. That will open the third trail for the park. The city hopes to have it opened in the next three months. In Easley, Nicole Ford, 7 News. A local nonprofit is donating more than $3,000 to help the city pay for signs throughout the park.